Bonjour à tous and welcome to Learn French with Vincent and we'll see in this video les expressions and more precisely one French expression Aller faire des courses Aller faire des courses Ok, so you can find here the translation in English and of course I will give you un exemple an example Hier, je suis allé faire des courses avec mes amis. Okay, so you can see that actually in this expression when you get aller faire des courses, well the part that you will have to conjugate will be aller. Okay, as it is the case here, so it's aller at the passé composé. Je suis allé. Okay, and the rest faire des courses doesn't change. Okay, so let's see now this expression. So if you want to actually use it at the present form, au présent. Je vais faire des courses. Okay, so you can see that you've got aller here and you conjugate it at the present. And then, je vais aller faire des courses. In that case, you've got this form that we call futur proche, the near future. So, I am going to go. It sounds a bit strange, I know, and normally we don't really use that, but it's possible anyway. Je vais aller faire des courses. Okay, j'irai faire des courses, so in that case it's exactly the same thing, so we just conjugate aller here, and this form is the real future, so what we call le futur simple, okay, j'irai faire des courses. And then another example at the imparfait, so a tense of the past, j'allais faire des courses. J'étais allé faire des courses, and in that case you've got this était allé form, and it's for le plus que parfait. And finally, j'irai faire des courses, and this is le conditionnel présent. Okay, so clearly I just wanted to show you that, well, you can use this expression at all the tenses, and so keep in mind that you will have to modify the verb aller, okay, according to the tense and to the subject as well. Ok And this is it for this expression. Merci beaucoup, au revoir et à bientôt.